I made a mistake. I'm going to be staying awake for the next 50 hours without a single second of sleep. At least, that's the goal. Some of you might be asking yourself, why is he even doing this? Doesn't he always talk about how important sleep is? Well, yes, but I have two good reasons. After these 50 hours, I'm going to be correcting my sleep back to normal and showing you exactly how I do it. Second, I posted a short about staying awake for 24 hours and the comments clowned on me. So, I had to double down. Alright, so today, we're starting off this challenge. Oh, frick, this has my directions on it. This thing in Utah. You're right in point three miles. Thank you. Called Parade of Homes. So, we're walking through some of the Parade of Homes. If we see anything lit, we'll show you it, but today... It's actually so much more fun than you think it would be. It, will, it actually is, because some of them are crazy. So, we've been striking out so far today, I feel like. There was a gun range in one of the Literal houses. Literal shooting range in a house, bruh. Like, real guns. Not BB guns, like, Heck real no. guns. It was like, sick inside in the basement. So there's some crazy stuff. So if we find some cool stuff, we'll show you. But so cool far, stuff. there is. We're striking out though. Like, Onward. We're modest. Yeah. Bye guys. <laughs> <laughs> this is freaking sick. This is right up our alleyway right here. You see the temple in the back? Heck of you time and stuff. It's huge house. Okay, this is pretty sick, bro. Look at that. For success, big old house. Okay, what's so, your guess? Okay, so after every single house, we always make a guess on how much we think it's gonna cost. Then we go look. Honestly, for this one, the freaking kitchen and everything was huge. We got a pool. I'm gonna say five mil plus. I was gonna say 5.5 .5 to six. But it only goes five mil plus, remember? So I think it's gotta be five mil plus. Okay, I'm gonna do 4.5 to five. Ooh. <laughs> it so might be close to there because this actually isn't as big as that other one that was five uh -huh. mil. Let's see how okay. big it is too. Okay, European chic. Is that it? That's it. Four to four point five. Really? It what was did a I lot say? smaller. You said four point five to five. And I said, said five, five plus. Five I was <laughs> off. I win. How many square feet? Lot price at? was only six fifty. Only six thousand square feet. We sound like oh, we, sound, we sound rich as a mobile right now. Get out of my phone to market. Uh -huh. We suck at guessing is what we got no. to. Okay, but in general, we're pretty freaking good. And I won that one. No, it's only if you I get it spot no, on, you get a point. No. Remember last round? You were like, oh, Bro, she's making up rules one. now. Let us know in the comments below who won. The rest of that day went pretty smoothly. We made it home, watched some TV, and next thing I knew, it was morning time. But I made a slight mistake. Well, I decided to go to training today, and I think that might have been the worst decision I've ever made in my entire life. I am freaking beat. I'm beat. I burned like... 1300 calories or something it was like a two hour session holy frick bro i am tired i don't know how i'm gonna keep staying awake for the next 22 hours at this point bro doing anything at all is a freaking mental battle like getting in the shower getting ready holy frick it's horrible i do feel a little more awake after the shower but overall bro i'm beat so i'm kind of just fighting for my life right now doing anything i can to stay awake i might like go outside in a little bit and just get some sun in my eyes but i'm struggling my boy the goal is ideally to stay out here for like five ten minutes it's a little bit cloudier every day so i'm gonna stay out a little bit longer but i just want my mind to realize that it's daytime but I don't know if this is going to do anything for me, but I'm trying every trick in the book. Honestly, I'm just trying to distract myself as much as possible. It might be a mistake getting to bed right now, but I can't help it. I'm beat, but I am on the home stretch. I shouldn't have done so much physical activity. Walking through those houses was freaking tiring. Training, freaking tiring. I should have just literally conserved my energy this entire time. But it is what it is. My mind, I just can barely even function right now i just filmed an entire clip literally was talking for so long i didn't even press record oh this is killer bro i can't believe people can do this straight up and voluntarily there were people commenting on my short i posted like oh that's nothing i stay up for 50 hours a day or 50 hours straight consistently why why the frick would you do that to yourself bro this is torturous maybe if i was like doing something crazy like i don't even know when this would be useful and that's the worst part about it nothing useful about it it's just torture literal mental torture um i'm still brushing my teeth and stuff which probably isn't the best idea because it's getting my mind thinking i'm getting ready for sleep but i'm brushing my teeth um then back to minecraft I go that time's very lonely so kind of the worst part um but once i get through this night gotta get back on a good schedule oh, 
The sun is going down, which means I'm on the home stretch. I'm getting freaking close, my boy. The journey is not over once I complete this challenge. I've just been working the entire day, basically, just trying to keep my mind occupied. This one, I can't really do too much entertaining stuff. Really, I'm just trying to survive, so. Um, I am on the home stretch, keep my mind occupied. I'm watching some YouTube right now, playing some Minecraft on my phone, just doing anything I can. We're almost there. <sighs> Good morning world. The challenge is complete. I just realized I didn't think through this very good because I'm ending the challenge on daytime. Oh, not the smartest idea in the world. I'll try to explain what I'm gonna do to correct my sleep, but I think it might be better to send it over to future me because I don't know if I'm gonna articulate this good, but let's see what I can do. I'm gonna take about a 20 minute nap here, no longer than 20 minutes, um, because then I'm just gonna get done dirty. And then I'm gonna try to stay around the same bedtime I normally fall asleep on um it's super important right now that i go outside and get some light um i need to eat meals on my normal schedule so i need to go eat some breakfast right now and then i sleep tonight uh yeah that was english i guess to keep it simple i'm going to trick my mind into thinking it's daytime to hopefully help myself stay awake until nighttime so my entire schedule isn't effed up at least that was the plan but the journey to recover from this challenge started way before the challenge even begun let me explain it turns out that there's no such thing is actually making up or lost sleep after the fact of it already happening you can only gain what's called a sleep credit so sleeping more before knowing you have something that'll cause lack of sleep so before this challenge i'm just bulking up a big old sleep credit that my body can take from during this challenge to hopefully make me not fall asleep so that's step one of this recovery way before the challenge even occurred but you guys have already seen the whole aftermath of this so you're probably freaking laughing at me now let's see how that idea did for me mm, i made a mistake <laughs> I made a mistake, but it felt so wonderful. So I turned off my alarm, went back to bed. I slept for like four hours just now. And oh my gosh, it felt so good. I'm kind of setting myself up for failure here, but this is going to take a few days to get back on track. And oh my gosh, it feels so good to sleep. And on that note, ladies and gentlemen, I guess now is probably a good time to tell each and every one of you, if it's not already obvious, not to try this challenge. I warn you, like, comment, subscribe. I'm never doing this again. Peace. Think they need more, I think they need more. Uh, this is second round, I'm trying to speak.